Rift role-playing project is a complete transformation of the Bethesda game Elder Scrolls Skyrim. It is a huge, ambitious undertaking expanding the game's size and scope to include the complete story of The Lord of the Rings. It began as a modification for the Elder Scrolls Morrowind, and over the years has evolved and advanced to a 35-person team working on this not-for-profit modification. However, in the middle of July, the team received a cease and desist letter from the Warner Brothers Corporation, halting the modification. The team announced this publicly in August of 2012. At that point, the mod makers got in touch with Warner Brothers, defending their mod as protected by the Fair Use Act, as it is a transformative piece of work done for no profit. They began a petition around the same time, which has received over 20,000 signatures and the leaders of these modification teams have said that the petition was to raise awareness to their plight and they have offered to remove it should Warner Brothers remove their copyright claim. It is believed by the leader known as Middle Earth Bane that this cease and desist letter was sent out out of worry that people would rather download this modification than play their video games Lord of the Rings War in the North and Lord of the Rings Guardians of Middle Earth. This has neither been confirmed nor denied by the Warner Brothers Corporation. If you wish to support these people and this mod, please visit www.moddb.com. As an update, a member of the Merc team, known as Alice Dare, has informed us they are now in talks with a new Warner Brothers representative, and hope to have an update soon. As always, more information will be presented to you as it becomes available to us. City of Heroes is a massively multiplayer online role-playing game set in Paragon City, a literal city filled with heroes. On August 31st, the company Insoft announced they were taking the game down and would be discontinuing its servers, and a group of people formed the Save City of Heroes movement. Insoft has not only recognized this group, but has responded to them, saying that they, quote, have done everything they could to sell City of Heroes. The leader of this movement does not see this as a bad thing, and still believes they can work out a deal with the company in Solve. However, time is running out, as the servers for City of Heroes will shut down on November 30th. So if you would like to help them, please contact www.savecoh.com. Thank you very much.